Right now, you're taking a live look over Marshall County this Tuesday morning for the Way 31 SkyCam Network. That area is continuing to see a rise in COVID-19 cases. According to the latest data, the 14-day average for new cases sits at 56 new cases a day. But the 7-day average is at 70 new cases a day. Well, the spike in cases is now leading to it's actually impacting school districts all across North Alabama. Way 31 Sierra Phillips joins us live now. Sierra, Boaz City Schools made the decision to go remote starting today. Why did they make this decision? The Boaz City Schools superintendent told me that it's because of the number of teachers and staff affected by the coronavirus that they made this switch. He said it's difficult to continue to do in person learning with the amount of people they have quarantined. Speaking of that, there are 18 coronavirus cases in the district with 170 people in quarantine. Before today's switch, the overwhelming majority of students were in person learning. 1,900 of its rough Roughly 2,300 students were enrolled in that traditional learning option. They'll now have to make the switch to remote for at least two weeks. We spoke with a parent who says her child was enrolled in virtual learning from the start. She said it's working well and she hopes other families can understand and adjust. The season, this it was change. Be, I knew coming up with this season, it was going to be out there, and just because a lot of people aren't taking as much protocol anymore. It, I knew it was going to happen, so I just was wanting to be more safe. Teachers and staff for now will continue to work in person in school, but like I said, students are starting remote today. Reporting live in Huntsville, Sierra Phillips, Way 31 News.